Good morning from our orchard and our grapevine and our garden again. Hey guys, I get asked all the time, how do you remediate your soil so that your vegetables grow really, really, really well? Well, we have an Amish timber yard up the road and we can get deliveries of wood chips and sawdust. So we have those delivered relatively cheaply because they have excess and can't get rid of it. Now, chip drop will also unload some wood chips at your house if you sign up for it. But so what we do is we do what's called a low till with my husband's tractor in our garden. And on top of that, we mix in uh, this really wonderful sack of peat moss. Um, and we do a one to one to one ratio. So what we do is we do essentially one part manure, one part peat moss, and then on top of that, uh, for weed control, we put on sawdust. Now that holds water retention and also keeps the weeds from coming up through it. But I'll show you some previous pictures of our garden. You'll be really surprised how beautiful our dirt looks. And as you can see, it's really coming along with how pretty that is. So around my tomatoes. I have sawdust, and there's not a lot of weeds coming through. Now over here where I don't have sawdust yet, I'm hiding from the tribe. I see that the weeds are coming. These are my beans, the weeds are starting to get Isn't that great? Look how beautiful it is. Now, the thing that you can do, obviously, is you can put your, your leaves on top of it, you can put wood chips, anything that's going to help bring organic matter back into your garden. You really want the worms because the worms also give you all those worm castings, great fertilizer. And then we also, you know, as our tomatoes get bigger, as we water down our chicken manure, put that on. Now straw does work, but straw you have to put down real, real, real thick because straw will also seed itself, which can be a whole nother problem. But anyway, that's how we remediate our soil. As you can see over here, we put wood chips along our grapevines and we also put some more sawdust so that's how we take care of our soil